Well, my name is Ajay. I am uh, the owner of AU Finja and I'm also an active board member in the Golden Jewelry Group in Dubai. And uh, yes, I think uh, Bangladesh is the future. I see a lot of Bangladeshis buying my product at Dubai airport when they are flying into Bangladesh maybe to buy for their loved ones, uh, when they are flying from Germany, from America or from UK or Canada, whenever they are flying back to Bangladesh, they are buying my product from the duty-free. So it's, a, it's good that they understand quality. It's very nice, actually. Uh, good security and uh, the way they have prepared that all the jewelers should have the same size of stall, which is also very, very, very good and very standard. Uh, in a short notice of 20 days to do something like this and prepare myself to come here to see this, it's really amazing. I would feel that uh, Bangladesh production should grow. I saw some of the local made products over here, which is very, very, very nice and very lightweight. Uh, of course, there's always a place for improvement, which I will see, I think so, in the coming years. I also would uh, advise that if we could do an FTA like uh, UAE did it with India, then Bangladesh can do it with UAE. So this FTA would grow the business and also the local jewelers will have more know-how to the international products on what they have to manufacture. And plus for the international market and for the people of Bangladesh who are so hardworking, I see women so hardworking here, they can also buy better products which are bought from outside. So UAE and uh, Bangladesh can have a better ties together and this would help the countries, both the countries to grow in the jewelry industry and I wish the best for the future. The way the people are working hard in the industry, this would really work, it will be. It will be a good show in the future. I think you have more than 100 stalls next year, 150 stalls next year would be wonderful. So if you're growing at uh, 50, 100 stalls every year, in a few years I think we should be at 300 stalls, which is a good size by itself. I think we will cover all the uh, halls over here, all the exhibition halls very soon. I saw some products, some of the products are too light for 22 karat, they should be a little heavier so that it sustains because when a person is buying jewelry it doesn't need to damage immediately there should be some time life cycle of the product so for products like rings and wrist wear the weight should go higher because on the wrist it's more prone to shocks so there will be some technical adjustments i think they will understand when they start manufacturing and this will only enhance the business i love bangladesh i love the food in bangladesh and uh, businessmen they are really business minded people and hard working people and you know uh, so many millions of Bangladeshis around the world are working hard and bringing money back to Bangladesh to grow Bangladesh. I feel uh, we should buy Bangladesh Taka, not US dollar, because I think Taka is improving day by day. And I think uh, it will be better for the uh, industry here as well as for the nation.